The White House says that U.S.-backed forces will soon control 100 percent of territory ISIS once held in Syria. But the fight is not over. Militants are cornered, not gone. Charlie Daggett has an update tonight from a military base in eastern Syria near the last sliver of ISIS territory. Well, U.S.-backed forces here are calling it the final push, Jeff, but already ISIS fighters are pushing back in what may prove to be a drawn-out and bloody battle. In an ISIS counterattack this morning, fighters took back territory and got close to overrunning this same Syrian Democratic Forces position we visited just days ago. A military spokesman told us there may be five to 600 fighters left, but they are among the most experienced and battle-hardened and determined within the ISIS ranks. They also underestimated the amount of civilians trapped inside that village, first thought to be around 1,500, they say about 1,500 came flooding out today alone. A U.S. and coalition airstrikes and artillery have been pounding ISIS positions since this offensive began on Saturday, and military officials say there is some progress to report. But those civilians, essentially human shields, are slowing down the offensive. Jeff? Charlie and team in Syria tonight. Charlie, thank you.